Why did prehistoric people make cave paintings? I mean, was it to pass messages on to each other? Or perhaps to boast about the hunt? See what I've caught? There must be something about making paintings in order to understand the animals that are surrounding them, how they moved, what they ate, and just how you related to them. So, I've got a bathroom that's a bit like a cave. You have to go down steps to get into it. And so I decided to paint my cave. Uh, I was going to do a lot of different murals and of sea creatures because bathrooms and water and sea definitely go together. So this is how I did it. First, sketch out your ideas. Do loads, do as many as you can, but keep them simple. Next, you have to make sure you've prepared the wall and the surface that you're going to paint on so it's got a really good purchase for your paint. First things first, I give it a good clean down with sugar soap. After that, I'm going to sand it down using, first of all, a coarse sandpaper and then a finer sandpaper. And call me old fashioned, I'm going to wear gloves to protect my hands. And a mask. Seen one of these before? Each of the murals are going to be under the sea and so I've got to start off with a background. So I'm going to use emulsion and I happen to have some grey emulsion here and some light blue. This is just what I happen to have but I'm going to start off with these as the background. And here's some of the panels uh, that have been painted with background uh, in situ. I found it very helpful to paint the shape of the animal on the sea background, to paint it in white, almost like it looked like a ghost. This helped me with the colours later because I was painting on a white background rather than on the blue background. A painting for the Armchair Painting Group, painted by Sand. <laughs> 